Now, if you do a lot of trout and red drum fishing, you know that the center point on that boat is the live bait tank. And a lot of people, you know, they'll be dipping their bait in and out of that live bait tank all day long. But here's a great way to avoid doing that because you don't know if the people that's with you may have sunscreen or some bug spray on their hands, which will in turn kill your live bait in your tank. Make up a bucket like this right here, a little short bucket or even smaller than this, and put about two to three inches of water in it. And what you can do is, is set six or eight shrimp in that bucket. And if you have people that's, that, that's scattered out around the boat that's fishing, they can actually take this bucket up with them to the front, or you can set it up on the side or even on your chair and look at here. Make sure every time you hook your bait on and you put them in the water, you see these legs down here moving when it gets in the water. And believe it or not, when them legs right there are moving, you'll get three times the bites is if you get a shrimp on there that's tired, weak, or it's been hit one time before, because many times, if this shrimp will, will see a fish coming at it, it'll actually start skipping away from the fish, and when it starts to try to uh, actually get away from the fish, it's gonna encourage that fish into striking, whereas if the bait is more lethargic and just lays there, many times the fish will look at it and swim right on by it and look for something else. So I'll put me a brand new one on here, and I'll put it right back out there again. And I just about bet you within 10 seconds I'll have a bite. 